For both men and women, we think about a big five risk factor. So smoking is the number one thing you can do to keep yourself healthy for many, many causes. If you do smoke, quit. If you don't smoke, don't start. Uh, have your blood pressure checked. We know that people with high blood pressure are more likely to develop um, cardiac uh, issues. Um, people with high cholesterol are also more likely to develop cardiac issues, so have your cholesterol checked routinely. People who uh, have diabetes, so know what your numbers are. Do you have high blood sugar? Has somebody in your family had high blood sugar? So that kind of cues you to get checked. And then the other thing we think about is actually age. We know that cardiac disease is a disease of aging, so the older we get, the more likely we are to develop cardiac disease. For women in particular, we think about menopause. So we feel that women are fairly well protected from cardiac disease before menopause. And as we go through menopause, a variety of things happen. Blood pressure rises, our weight rises, our blood pressure rises, sorry, our cholesterol and our blood pressure rise. So it puts us in a more vulnerable position and we will be more likely to develop coronary disease after menopause. Having said that, we're seeing more and more coronary disease in young women. So it's really important to think about our, our big risk factors of high blood pressure, high cholesterol, smoking, and diabetes, and age, and really be aware of what those numbers are and treat them aggressively.